What's up everybody? Today I'll be making a Guyanese style Chinese fried chicken just like the ones you'll find at the restaurants. All you need is a few ingredients and a few tools and you'll have amazing, amazing results. I'll be breaking it down step by step so you can see how to make this delicious chicken at home. First off, I'll be starting with the ingredients. I have Sichuan peppercorns, Chinese five spice, salt, sesame oil, some garlic cloves, fresh, I also have some fresh ginger, scallions, and a three pound bird. This will be perfect for this recipe. For tools, I have a knife, a cutting board, and I have two Ziploc bags. We'll make everything super easy and simple. Now, let's get started. First up, I'll break down my chicken. I'll stand it up. And what I'll do is I'll take my knife and in between the neck bone and the wing bone, what I'll do is I'll put my knife there and I'll go all the way down and it opens it up. Next up, what I'll do is I'll go between the cavity and you can take out all of the liver and all that. And what I'll do next is I'll take my knife and go right in between that blade. And then I'll just go all the way through, just like that. Very simple. And that's how you break down a chicken in half. And I'll place these in my Ziploc bags. Next up, what I'll do is I'll smash my garlic. And I'll place half in one bag and half in the other. And I'll do the same with my ginger. So I'll slice my ginger up. And now what I'll do is I'll smash it up with the base of my knife. Just enough to bruise it. And I'll place that in there. Scallions, I'll do the same. I'll bruise the bottom up and I'll place it in my bags. And I'll add half the salt to one and half the salt to the other. Same with the Sichuan peppercorns. Same with the five spice. And sesame oil. So now you can let this sit for at least three hours. The best results is if you let it sit overnight. So next up, I'll be steaming my chicken. And what I have here is a steamer and I have some water on the bottom. Be very careful because this is nice and hot. And I have some water in here, as you can see, it's about a quarter way up. And I'll place my steam basket over it. And the lid goes like that. And now I'll grab my chicken. It's been marinating for at least three hours and I'll place it right in here. So my chicken goes like so. And I'll have all the aromatics in there as well too. This will add flavor. And now I'll let this go for at least 15 minutes. So after 15 minutes, this is how your chicken should look. Nice and beautiful. And now what I'll do is I'll take my tong and I'll take it out of here and I'll place it on a cooling rack. So now I have my oil going and you wanna get your oil to about 350 degrees and you wanna have enough that your chicken can be submerged. And what I'll do while my oil comes to temperature, I'll pat my chicken dry. And this is very important because you don't want any splattering. Chicken to my frying oil. So this is your beautiful Guyanese style Chinese fried chicken. And as you can hear, nice and crispy. And now you'll let this rest when it comes out of the fryer for about 20 minutes, and then you can dig into it. So finally, that's it. You will love this crispy Guyanese Chinese chicken. It is super delicious. 
and it is packed with flavor. So please try this amazing chicken recipe. And again, thank you for watching. If you like this recipe, please give it a big thumbs up. Drop some comments below and please share and subscribe. Again, thank you so much and please try this chicken. You will love it as I do every time I make it. It is super juicy and super delicious.